Hi everyone, it's Miss Amy um, here doing another Imagine Your Story creation challenge. So this week we're going to be doing the tortoise and the hare, which is one of Aesop's fables. So there's usually some kind of moral or lesson to the story. So see if you can figure out what it is. All right, so once there was a hare, which is another word for a rabbit, that was very good at running and she liked to boast about how fast she was. I can run faster than the wind blows. Nobody can beat me in a foot race. Not many of the animals were willing to race her, but the tortoise thought he would give it a try. The hare didn't believe that something as slow as the tortoise could win. Sure thing, there's no way a slow pose like you can beat me. So the tortoise and the hare prepared for their race. Okay, so we're gonna go around the fence, through the field, up the hill, around the vegetable garden, and over to the gate. They got to the starting line and a friend called out, on your mark, get set, go. And they were off. And of course, Hare jumped out to an early lead. And Tortoise took one step after another, slow and steady. Hare was racing through the course. And Tortoise kept taking one step after another, slow and steady. Then Hare reached the vegetable garden. Surely I have time for a snack and a quick rest. That slow poke is never going to catch up to me. And Hare ate a snack and fell asleep. And Tortoise just kept taking one step after another, slow and steady. Eventually, Tortoise reached the vegetable garden and saw that Hare was still napping. Tortoise passed by the Hare, still just taking one step after another, slow and steady. Hare was dreaming of all the animals cheering for her when she won the race. But it turns out those cheers weren't only in her dreams. So what's the lesson from our story? Slow and steady wins the race. I hope you enjoyed our story of the tortoise and the hare. I'd like to encourage you to uh, create something related to the story. Maybe you want to draw a picture. Maybe you want to run a race yourself and act it out. You could design or build um, a race course maybe for some animals out of Legos or other building supplies that you might have. Or maybe you even want to design uh, an obstacle course for yourself and siblings or friends. Um, whatever you'd like to create, I encourage you to do so. We're going to meet virtually via Zoom this Thursday, July 9th at 4 p.m. We're going to read a story version, another story version of the tortoise and the hare, and we can talk about any creations you have made. So again, we're going to meet this Thursday, July 9th at 4 p.m. The link to sign up will be in the description of this video and posted to our library website as well. Thanks for watching.